welcome to the United States Army Sergeant's Major Academy, the home of non-commissioned officer education. USASMA has had a long and storied history, which came as a result of the Department of the Army approving the establishment of the non-commissioned officer education system in 1969. Three years later, Army Chief of Staff General William Westmoreland approved the creation of a senior level NCOES, and on July 1, 1972, USASMA was born. The first class was assembled at Biggs Army Airfield, Fort Bliss, Texas on January 15, 1973. This class of 105 students, including Master Sergeant Betty Benson, the first female student, were the pioneers of what has since become an institution of excellence and the world's premier leadership institution for non-commissioned officers. In order to meet the needs of the Army for training senior NCOs, the Academy began offering the Sergeant's Major non-resident course via correspondence studies the very next year. In August of 1975, the Academy expanded its training of NCOs to include international soldiers and welcomed Robert J. May of Australia into Class 6 of the Sergeant's Major course. Since then, the Academy has welcomed international students from more than 74 countries such as Afghanistan, Bulgaria, Colombia, Jordan, and the Ukraine. The Academy also hosts students from the United States Air Force, the United States Navy, the United States Marine Corps, and the United States Coast Guard. The original mission of the Academy was to provide select senior NCOs an educational experience to qualify them for promotion to Sergeant Major and to serve in higher levels of responsibility throughout the Army and the Department of Defense. As the Academy became more proficient in managing and maintaining the Sergeant's Major course, it began to expand its development of the NCO Corps through other professional development courses. The first new course the Academy developed was the First Sergeant Course. While not a tenant of the NCO education system, the First Sergeant Course provided prospective First Sergeants with tools they needed to successfully manage a unit. In October of 1981, USASMA became the Army's proponent for developing common leader training for all NCO education courses, and in that same year developed the curriculum for the primary leadership course, the precursor to the Warrior Leader course of today. The growing number of leadership courses meant the Academy inevitably had to expand its classroom space. So in November of 1985, USASMA broke ground on a modern facility and two years later relocated to its current home on what is today known as East Fort Bliss. The Sergeant's Major Academy continued to grow in both mission and responsibility and by 1991 began instruction of the Battle Staff NCO course. That same year, the Academy began publishing the NCO Journal, the military's only magazine dedicated to NCO professional development. As technology advanced, so did USASMA's ability to train NCOs, and in 1994 conducted the first ever distance learning training event of the primary leader development course to soldiers serving in the Sinai. In August of 1995, the Sergeant's Major course expanded to a nine-month program of instruction. Two years later, another wing was added to the school to accommodate the non-resident Sergeant Major Course, Battle Staff NCO Course, First Sergeant Course, and the Battle Command Training Branch. In 2000, USASMA began the Classroom 21 Initiative, a modernization program to transform current classrooms from an instructor-centered environment to a student-centered multimedia environment with worldwide access to approved training materials. By 2005, the Academy began providing the basic non-commissioned officer course Common Core to the entire Army by way of video teletraining, established the Battle Command Simulation Center, and transformed the primary leadership development course into the Warrior Leader course. Two years later, the Academy became responsible for developing a program of instruction to augment traditional NCO education courses. The result was a major step forward in development and introduction of structured self-development. This training fills the gap between NCO education courses and promotes the lifelong learning objectives through distributive learning and interactive multimedia instruction. In 2009, the Academy became a direct reporting unit to Training and Doctrine Command and transformed into an NCO-led organization with the selection of Command Sergeant Major Raymond F. Chandler III as the Commandant. That same year, USASMA was recognized with the Superior Unit Award and revised the Sergeant's Major course into a 10-month program of instruction. 
The next year, the Academy ceased construction of the First Sergeant's course and implemented the Advanced Leaders course, Common Core, formerly known as the Basic Non-Commissioned Officer course, Common Core. In 2011, USASMA was named an Institution of Excellence by Training and Doctrine Command, an outstanding organizational achievement that was reaffirmed in 2014. USASMA continues its efforts to ensure NCO education remains relevant and in 2013 updated the Warrior Leader course into a 22-day program of instruction and developed the Commandant's Pre-Command course to help Command Sergeant Majors transition into their roles as leaders of the Army's 34 NCO academies. In 2014, the Academy also took the lead in the development of the Master Leader course to help prepare Sergeants First Class for their future roles as Master Sergeants and First Sergeants. Further cementing the Sergeant's Major Academy as an institution of excellence, USASMA has established a fellowship program through Penn State University that provides 20 scholarships a year to select Sergeant's Major to earn a master's degree in adult education. These Sergeant's Major go on to be instructors in the Sergeant's Major course for three years, thus elevating the educational experience of the students and increasing the academic experience to a graduate level. USASMA has continually adapted to fully support and deliver more than 400 classes to some 300,000 soldiers annually. The education they receive not only develops them personally, but prepares them to lead the next generation of soldiers. USASMA is acknowledged by military and civilian organizations as the premier non-commissioned officer education institution in the world. This is a result of our innovation, agility, and forward-looking approach to leader education and development. Our soldiers are well-educated, committed, non-commissioned officers, the backbone of America's Army. The U.S. Army Sergeant's Major Academy is proud to take the lead in educating today's leaders for tomorrow and stands ready to fulfill its mission of providing professional military education that develops enlisted leaders to meet the challenges of an increasingly complex world. USASMA is an institution of academic excellence supported by world-class staff and faculty. Welcome to Team Altima, Altima Strong.